Joseph Bulmer here, and behind me is a 2013 Chevrolet Equinox with a 240 Detect. Today I'm going to show you how to set up the timing on the balance shaft chain. So if you're putting in a whole new timing set, new balance shaft chain, new timing chain, uh, I'm going to show you how to set up the balance shaft chain, and then if you look at the end of the video, there will be a uh, card at the end of the video, or an end screen, that you can click on that, and that will take you to the video on how to set up the timing components in this engine for the actual timing chain for the, the camshaft. So the balance shaft chain is very important that you get that set up properly because there's an intake balance shaft, there's an exhaust balance shaft, and those keep the engine from vibrating when it's running. And it is recommended if the timing chain, if you're replacing the timing set, you, you should replace the balance shaft set as well because the guides are both going to be equally, you know, theoretically they're going to be equally worn. Um, and while you're in there doing the balance shaft, the balance shaft chain also drives a water pump. Uh, you could change the water pump on these vehicles if you have the special tools without removing the balance shaft chain. But if you're doing the timing set in the balance shaft chain, I do recommend that you just go ahead and do the water pump while you're in there. It'll save you time in the long run. So we're going to dive right into that. I'm going to show you what's going on. But in the meantime, if you are new to the channel, please click the subscribe button. If you've already subscribed, make sure you hit that notification bell so you get notifications on all my upcoming videos. If you have any questions about this, please drop them in the comment section. I'd be more than happy to answer them for you. And, as always, when it's all over with, please don't forget to rate the video, guys. Okay. The setup balance shaft timing. I need to get my odd colored link onto the timing mark on the intake balance shaft. Get it up there and then I'll move it if I need to. We're just gonna kind of route this through for the moment. Okay, so. That should be it right there, yep. And that's going to put this mark. This should line up right there. Just like it. Come on. up right there. right there let's double check okay so we've got shiny or what they're calling white and another one right there on that timing mark and then this one should be where's my arrow the yellow should be straight up Yeah. And we'll them up with some
watching, I showed you how to set up the balance shaft chain. I'll put the card up here, and that will take you to the video for the timing set on how to set up the actual cam timing. So do me a favor, guys. Don't forget to rate the video. Subscribe if you haven't done it already, please. And if you have any questions, throw them in the comment section. I'll, I'll be more than happy to try and answer them for you. And don't forget, guys, get out there, get your hands dirty. You might have a little fun doing it. We'll see you on the next one.